we're told that a polynomial, I don't know what that polynomial is, we'll call it P, polynomial must be added to this thing right here, and the sum that it creates, in other words, the result of the addition, is negative 7x squared plus 3x. And this one is, this is complicated if you try to hold it all in your head, but I find it's much easier if you try to take this in baby steps. And the first thing I want to do is fix this polynomial right here so it doesn't look quite so ugly. And the way I'm going to do that is by distributing the multiplication. So I'm going to take that 3 on the outside and multiply it through. This becomes negative 9x squared minus 3x minus 18. Okay, so what polynomial p must be added to what I just wrote, such that the sum is negative 7x squared plus 3x? Well, think about it this way. This is going to be some kind of an addition problem. Okay, x squared, something times x squared, plus something times x, plus some number, something. And we're going to add those. See, that's p that I just wrote, that, that bunch of red uh, terms right there. We're going to add that to this, negative 9x squared minus 3x minus 18. We're going to add the whole thing up like an addition problem. And the result that we're going to get is this, negative 7x squared, positive 3x, and 0. Okay, So I find it's easier to look at this way, because now I can sort of cut these things apart one at a time. Something times x squared minus 9x squared equals negative 7x squared. Well, if you're thinking about that in your head, you might come up with 2x squared. 2x squared minus 9x squared equals 7x squared. Okay, so there we go. 2x squared. And then the next one. Something minus 3x equals 3x. Well, how about 6x? 6x minus 3x equals 3x. So this is going to be plus 6x. And then, last color here, something minus 18 equals 0. Well, this is the easiest one of all. That, that must be 18. So 18 minus 18 equals 0. So here's my polynomial. 2x squared plus 6x plus 18. If you add that to this right here, you're going to get the result negative 7x squared plus 3x. Now, what I just did, what I went through, is a process of turning a, a written paragraph into a little bit more of a math equation. See, these things are not so bad to solve once we make equations out of them, but uh, the challenge may be arranging it in such a way that we can solve it. This is essentially a polynomial subtraction problem.